What's up Baller Nation? Augie Johnson here with BallerBootCamp.com and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys a nice little step back move one that's kind of been made famous by Kemba Walker. But before we get into the video, real quick, crush that like button, hit that subscribe button if you're new, and let's go ahead and get right into this breakdown. Yeah. All right guys, so here we go, let's break this down. First things first is you need to be able to have proper footwork on the crossover. So whenever, whenever I do a crossover, I need, as soon as the ball switches hands, I need to be taking a step with this other foot, okay, like a big cross step. It's an important part of doing this move. Because what we're gonna do with this, we're gonna do a big cross over here. We're gonna go like we're blown by the defense and then we're gonna step back and shoot a step back right in space right here um, before we even take another dribble. Now at the end, I'm gonna show you a second variation that you can use to uh, create a little bit more space and be on balance a little bit better. But for this first variation, all it looks like is you're here, cross over, cross step, step back into your jump shot. Now what makes this possible, and something that I teach a lot in a lot of my videos, if you're new, then this is new, gonna be new to you, is anytime you do a crossover, you can actually run with that ball in your hand. You'll even see players go here, do a crossover, and not even take another dribble by the time they get to the basket and shoot a layup. So they'll just do a crossover outside the NBA three-point line, get to the basket without even taking another dribble, due to the fact that they're running with that ball in hand, and they still have that live dribble. That's what makes this not a travel, is because as long as my hand's on top of the ball, my, my dribble is still live. I haven't picked up my dribble yet, so I can put it back down, therefore I can take those steps. So half speed real quick, one more time. I'm here, crossover, right into it. Step back, jump shot, knock it down. So let's go ahead and take a look at that full speed. For the second variation, we're going to actually take a dribble after the crossover now. Now both these shots are pretty advanced step backs and ones that I don't recommend that beginners try. But if you're advanced, work on this and maybe this is something you guys can do in the game. So for the second variation, it's the same thing. We're going to have a big crossover like an Allen Iverson type crossover. But this time we're going to go with the ball and we're actually going to take another dribble before we step back. Now what this does is this kind of sells the fact that we're driving by the defense a little bit more. And also, it allows us to get on balance before we step back so that we can create a little bit more space with that pound and pull dribble, okay? So, one more time, here it is, slow motion. Crossover, I'm blowing by, boom, pound it and step back. Okay, so like I said, we're still gonna have that ball in our hand, running with the ball. One more time, boom, I'm running, and then boom, I'm pounding and stepping back. So, I think you guys get the idea. Let's go ahead and take a look at this full speed. Guys got the most fundamental way to do this. I'm just gonna show you guys full speed live, a few different little variations. It's pretty much the same move, but out of different dribble combos, etc. So let's go ahead and check that out. All right guys, I hope you guys liked that video. If you did, hit that like button, let me know. Also, leave me a comment, let me know what other kind of videos you wanna see. If you're new, subscribe, but most importantly, head over to ballerbootcamp.com. Head over there, I got a free workout that you can download, print out, and follow to improve your shooting, improve your ball handling. So all you have to do is click the first link in the description or any link that's on this screen right now. So go ahead and click one of those links right now, and I'll see you guys in the next video.